So um, we've got another exciting 10-15 um, minutes of pitches from our top startups. So once again, um, we've got about 100 startups here at the conference. Um, the top 28, it seems like an arbitrary number, but there is a, a reason behind it, are just outside in this corridor here. And we've had eight already, the, the growth startups who have raised between three and 10 million. Uh, we're now coming into the grind category, so there'll be two uh, more pitches, including this one today. Uh, 10 here, 10 uh, grind companies, and then 10 uh, a bit later on. So just to give you some information about the program, um, in the, the top 28 that I mentioned, top 28 alone, there are 15 different countries uh, and industries such as fintech, healthcare, manufacturing, and technologies like AI, um, software as a service, blockchain. So lots of really, really interesting stuff. So I'd really recommend that listen up. I know it's just before lunch, but maybe you're kind of like so excited about food that you're even more alert, hopefully. Um, but definitely, you know, listen in and go and chat to them, whether you're eating or not eating, and uh, it'll be worth your while. So what we're going to do is each person is going to have a one-minute pitch, and they're going to be um, cut off by, with, a, with a gong at the end. Um, but I'm sure they'll all um, smash it out of the park with the, within that minute. So looking forward to it. So first off, we have Lexical Labs. Thank you. Good clap. Routine commercial contracts. Everybody hates them. They stop business getting done. But let's face it, you can't do business without them. These contracts get stuck in the pipeline for days, waiting for someone to review them. Frustrated customers complain about delays or worse, walk away. Frankly, a lawyer has more important things to do than spending hours reviewing yet another routine contract. I'm Liam Gilchrist, CEO and founder of Lexical Labs. Our AI-enhanced virtual lawyer solves this problem by reviewing these contracts for you. So it's a simple concept. We build you a digital playbook of the rules your lawyers look for, and then we review your contracts as your lawyers would. So businesses can review contracts without the expensive lawyers. Lawyers can do interesting work without the drudgery. And deals can get done simply and cheaply without the roadblocks. Come and see us afterwards. We're just outside. Thank you very much. Cheers. Lexical Labs. Next up, Space Connect. Over the last five years, the commercial office environment has had an, undertaken a significant shift. WeWork and Notel and others have really changed the expectations of employees and the physical asset environment. But the problem still exists. People still can't find meeting rooms. They still can't work, and you need to agree to work out how an AV system works inside a meeting room. And they can't find desks and where their colleagues are. Now picture a future when you wake up in the morning and you know exactly where you need to be the easiest and fastest way to get there. And when you get into the office, you know exactly where your desk will be, and you walk into a meeting room, and everything works for you. And you might have invited somebody to a meeting outside of your organization, and they are automatically detected when they arrive, and you're alerted to that. And then you might need to move between offices throughout the day, and Space Connect automatically recognizes for you where you need to go and what you need to do. That is the future that we see for the commercial office environment. My name is Matt Pope. I'm the founder of Space Connect, and come and see us. Cheers. Perfect. Space Connect. Stack. Hi. In 1997, when I was seven years old, the first internet browser with tabs was introduced. Since then, the internet itself has evolved drastically. Yet to gain access to it, all of us in this room still use the old-fashioned web browsers with almost the same design as 22 years ago. This is exactly what we're challenging by introducing Stack, an alternative internet launchpad that changes the way people interact with the internet and uh, enhances the efficiency of working with web. Stack is the next step in web browser evolution, making sure that all your web apps are perfectly organized, uh, allowing you to be more productive while working with web and making sure that you never miss what's most important to you. My name is George, and I'm a co-founder of Stack. We're building the most intuitive tool for managing all apps in one space, and we're more than happy to welcome you to our journey. Thank you. Thank you very much, Stack. Next up, Sidichi. Companies in the regulated sector, like banks, are in a difficult position. On the one hand, they have to comply with data protection and bank secrecy regulations, which are all about sharing, sorry, about keeping customer information secret. But on the other hand, they also have to comply with anti-money laundering regulations, which are about the opposite, sharing customer information. 
As a result from these conflicting requirements, banks are paying fines in the millions and billions of dollars for non-compliant issues. At Sedici, we have developed a solution to this problem, which extends to two important processes. One is customer onboarding, and the other one is AML transaction monitoring. Our cryptographic technology is patented, is fast, is very robust and secure, and it's also unique in the world. If you would like to learn more about Sedici, just come and talk to us. We're right there outside of the door on your right. Thank you very much. Some great startups, right? Awesome. Additive flow. Perfect. Engineers can only design with what they know. And right now, 70% of engineers do not use 3D printing because of a lack of knowledge. That is an amazingly high missed opportunity. Companies are missing out on cost savings, accelerated time to market, and high performance products that can compete. And our software helps that. Additive Flow has generative design software, uses AI-enhanced physics-validated simulation to recommend exactly which material, which manufacturing process, and which, which unlocks the unabled, um, excuse me. This is an example of the kind of thing that we're building. It's multi-material. It enables designers to select which point of this object needs material and puts it in exactly the right place. Nice. Always good to bring props. I like that. <laughs> Thank you. Let's enhance. Hi, everyone. My name is Sophie. I'm the CEO of Let's Enhance. And we build AI-powered tools to automate image enhancement at scale. With the development of 4K, 8K streams, the demand of high-quality content was constantly rising and will reach 48 billion market in 2021. However, the problem is that most of the existing content is still low res. And we are solving this problem using our own AI research. We have almost 1 million users at the platform and sell it to companies like e-commerce, marketplaces, and real estate. So if you are interested in how the AI is disrupting visual tech industry, come to, to me to my booth on the left on the main stage. Thank you. Thank you very much, Sophie. And let's enhance. Caliber. Thank you. Hi, I'm not a technologist. I'm a branding specialist. And the 20 years I spent in this field taught me that companies increasingly need to know what people think about them and to act on that in order to gain trust and actually have a right to exist. And not only people who are vocal on social media, but all people who matter to them. Caliber is a B2B SaaS platform that continuously surveys stakeholders and provides real-time reputation analytics that allow companies to make better decisions and gain trust. We launched it a couple of years ago in Denmark and now have some of the largest companies there signed up to the platform with annual recurring revenues of around 300,000 euros. We're fully bootstrapped and a profitable company but now we're seeking funds to help us grow beyond Denmark. Companies today spend nearly $10 billion on such research services every year and still fail to build trust. Caliber is here to fix that. Thank you. Very good. Thank you. And C4P. Hi, my name is Andreas. Well, in C4P, what we are trying to do is to uh, create software that makes great business decisions. I come from the corporate world, so uh, I had to take these kind of decisions uh, pretty much every day. And uh, that has to do with how your company will, uh, will grow or will die. Now we live in the great era of AI, and we have machines that ca we can simulate them think like that. Of course, uh, we are not so uh, uh, naive to think that we will simulate uh, the human brain across all sectors. So we are, the problem we are focusing now very much in is to build an assistant to help uh, business developers grow their business with the public sector. Now, our clients are some of the smartest people in this industry, so that's good for us. And we, we will grow in other uh, sectors when we get from our clients that, ah, I have not thought of that. Your platform showed us something that we have never thought. I 
about you guys, but I just love the variety. Like, you know, so many different types of companies, so many different types of technologies. It's great to see. Thank you very much, C4P. Automaze. Hey, everyone. So imagine you can help your teams not waste half of their time on unproductive tasks, repetitive, low added values. Imagine you transfer all that energy into the high added value performance. We can help you get there. Automize is a low-code AI automation platform for enterprises where you can deploy any automation about any process that you are struggling with right now. Um, we work with telco, um, insurance, banking, retail clients. And um, right now, um, as an example that I could give you, for one of our clients who managed to automate 83% of their social customer support. So that's just one example. We can do many other things. Um, and um, if you want to boost your productivity, you can find Automize on the right outside and uh, talk to us. Thank you very much. Everyone's getting their lefts and rights correct as well, which is good. <laughs> and last but definitely not least, there we go, AlphaBlock. Hello, my name is Andre. I resent AlphaBlock. The problem that asset managers are facing today is a lack of performance, lack of efficiency. More than 80% of them are underperforming. Using our unique general AI solution, we are helping them uh, and building for them global automated uh, asset management solutions that help them uh, beat the benchmark and their own performance. We have uh, clients in Canada, US, India, and Europe, and uh, we have also validated our solution for other domains. Um, the general AI that we have built can anticipate any time series data sets, and we have used data sets from energy, retail, and uh, payments to be able to demonstrate our capability. The listed uh, RMI VG20 model on NASDAQ, it's outperforming the benchmark uh, since 2014, having almost doubled the performance of uh, NASDAQ Composite Index. We are looking for uh, the most important anticipation question that you might have, and we invite you to um, talk to us to assist you into answering that. Bang on time. So can we just have one massive round of applause for all the startups? It was amazing. Thank you so much, guys. Definitely come see them. Have a great rest of the day. See you later on. Thank you.